Welcome back to Simmy's Kitchen. So today I am making some fried rice and some fried chicken. So in here in my pot I have um, some peas and corn and peppers and green onions. And I've added um, just a pack of frozen peas and a pack of frozen corn. About four, five sweet peppers and four stalks of green onions. Now for the seasoning, I just have some simple um, chicken bouillon and adobo. And that's all you'll need for the seasoning. Um, let this cook for about um, five to seven minutes already. I'm going to cover it and let it cook for a little bit more. And that'll be it. Then we're going to add our rice to this. Now for this, you would, you can use fresh rice or you can use frozen today i'm using frozen because i made a big pot of rice yesterday and i'm going to use it up so um i'm just going to cover this and we're going to come back but before okay y'all so i'm back i added in my um i forgot to tell y'all i'm putting sausage in here smoked sausages and you could add any kind of meat that you would like you just have to pre-cook the meat and then add it in when you get ready to um make your rice so I added in my rice and all I did was give it a really good stir, mix it all together, incorporate it all together really good. And I'm just going to cover this. I'm going to let it cook for another five to seven minutes and that'll be it on this dish. Now it's not cooking for very long because the rice is already cooked, the vegetables are already cooked, so it doesn't really take long. To this, you could also add egg if you want. Um, you could add more vegetables than I have. You could add peas, um, green beans, carrots, more peppers, onions, whatever you want to add to this. It's, this is such a versatile recipe. You could add whatever you want to this. Um, you could add any kind of meat you want. Um, and that's it. For my seasoning, this was about a teaspoon, a tablespoon of the chicken bouillon. And with this, I only add in um, about a tablespoon, tablespoon and a half, because you know, this could be very salty. So you don't want to go ahead and add too much. And I did the same thing with my adobo. Adobo as well could be salty. So I just add a tablespoon. If you want more, um, it doesn't taste, you know, the way you want. I would suggest you add more of the adobo and not more of the chicken bouillon because then you, you mess with some salt and, you know, you don't want your dish to be too salty and you, you got to throw that away. But that's it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed my rice recipe, uh, my fried rice recipe, and give it a try. So, like I said, you could add any kind of vegetables peppers, onion, green beans, peas, corn, carrots, um, whatever you want, broccoli, you could add egg to it. Now with the egg, I will add the egg. I will cook the egg first, you know, scramble it and add it in. If you don't want to scramble, just fry you a, a nice hard boiled egg, a hard, um, hard fry egg or a over easy egg. And it's so good with this. Trust me. I know I did it. Um, and you can add any kind of meats you want to this, you know. Um, I just added in some small sausages because that's what I wanted. But I've done it with chicken or, you know, anything else you want to add. So I'm going to go check on my fried chicken and I'll be back. Plate it up so you guys can see, okay? Okay, y'all. So here's the finished product. I have my fried chicken and my fried rice with peas, corn, peppers, and small sausage. I hope you guys enjoy this recipe and give it a try. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Please do like, share, and subscribe. Give it a thumbs up if you like it. All right, you guys have a good day.